Okay, last time we solved this inequality x squared minus 2x minus 35. I mean minus 35 is less than or equal to 0. So what we did, I'm going to want to which uh, we solve the list the natong less than or equal by equality. Then whatever is the result, the result, the solution for that is what we call the critical points. So on critical points dito, solutions for this equation. This equation is x equals 5 and x equals 7. Now let's draw that in the number line. So negative 5 somewhere here, 7 somewhere here, right? Let's now make a table. Table first. Okay. First critical point, so actually not critical points. Notice na ang number line na divide into three, three parts, three parts, so three intervals. First interval is from negative infinity, kaninga part, negative infinity to negative 5. These are the numbers that are basta negative infinity or positive infinity, op open interval and uh, parenthesis in gamitan. So, negative infinity to negative 5. These are the numbers that are less than or equal to negative 5. So, more on first part. Numbers that are less than or equal to negative 5. So, negative 6, negative 7, negative 8, and so on. So, more on first part na 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 tunga siya. Second is kaning tunga, which is actually the solution. Na akong yata. Negative. Let's try this again negative negative 5 to 7 so ang mga numbers there is negative 5 appeal ang negative 5 because because it's less than or equal to because of this less than or equal to okay so appeal is negative 5 if less than or not siya, then it's an open interval but anyway let's we will solve that later kung what if what if uh, strict inequality so that's the second part that ang um, resultan niya diri this is purple right so muna ka tong mga nasa tunga so negative 5 negative uh, 4 negative 3 negative 2 1 0 uh, 1 2 huh? negative 5 negative 4 negative 3 negative 2 negative 1 0 1 2 until 7 so, one is lang second part. Kani. Which is, I said, this is the solution sa problem. As to why that is the solution, we'll see. And then, last part is this. This one. 7 to there. 7 to positive infinity. These are the numbers that are greater than 7 including 7. So, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, so on. Again, open interval lang infinity. So, uh, ang number lang, natunga siya sa tulok parts. So, negative infinity, negative 5. The interval negative infinity, negative 5. The interval negative 5, 7, and the interval 7, positive infinity. So, let's write that here. Negative is the, the intervals. First, negative infinity, negative 5, then negative 5, 7, and then 7 to positive infinity. Okay, now let's choose test points. Test points, DP. Sending test points. Let's choose a representative from each interval. Isa lang. So, from negative, there is a negative infinity, negative 5, you can choose 
we can choose negative 6, di ba? Negative 6 is somewhere here. I could choose negative 6 because it's here. It belongs to that interval. So, for here, we have negative 6. For, in this next interval, we have 0 because 0 is somewhere sa tunga. 0, we can have 0. And then, there is a 7 to positive infinity, we can have 8. So, 8. Those are the test points. Now, so, para sa yung test points? Gamito natin na siya para isa, i-check kung unsa yung mahitabo. Unsa yung mahitabo if i-substitute natin yung test points sa given ng inequality. Kanyang inequality. Unsa yung mahitabo? Anong expression dahi? Unsa yung mahitabo? Anong expression if i-substitute natin na siya sa I mean, i-substitute natin mga test points dira sa factor form, factor form, say factor form ani x plus 5 mo ni factor form diba sa tali man ang i-evaluate ang factor form x minus 7 po i-substitute ba nato for example, una sa negative 6 diri sa x plus 5 times x minus 7 kung sa'yo yung mahitabo, kung um, sa'yo result positive, negative, or 0 alright so, kung negative 6, if x equals negative 6, let's do that. Negative 6, if x equals negative 6, x equals negative 6, say metabo. So, we have negative 6 plus 5, that's negative 1. And then, we have negative 1 minus 7, it's 3 minus Negative, oh, this is so messy. I will clean this up later. So, what happens? X plus 5, X minus 7. So, negative 1, negative 1, and so, negative 6, if we list any actually negative 6, dira. negative 6 plus 5 is negative 1. Negative 6 minus 7 is negative 13. So, it's both negative, tama. So, therefore, ang result niya is may mong positive, greater than 0. So, may mong siyang negative times negative, dali. Which is, product may mong siyang positive. Product. Next, what if 0? Oh, madali lang yan. 0, let's erase. If 0 ni siya sa taas, 0 ni siya, then we have positive negative, right? Positive, positive 5, and then just negative 7. So, positive times negative, negative. Next, 8. So, 8 times 5, tagulo ha. 8 plus 5, 13. So, that's positive. Then, 8. 8 times. Oh, that's so messy. Yeah, it's so messy, I know. 8 minus 7 is 1. So, it's still positive. So, 1. Positive. Positive times positive. Positive. Now, ang given na problem na ngayon sa Na nga, dapat, ang sa mga values sa x or actually intervals nga mahitabo, negative ang result, ani ani nga expression. So, aha man naman negative, kani kani diri kani nga interval kani nga interval negative 5, 7. That's why I said na this is the this is the solution. Negative 7 or if hindi ka ganang interval notation kung sulat ni mo siya or you could say numbers that are between less than or equal to 7 but greater or equal to negative 5. So, yun na nang afford yung gamitin. Okay lang po. So, muna nagpapasabutan ng interval. 
So next video, we'll try to solve what if what if greater what if greater than or equal to. So what if greater than or equal to or what if strictly less than na po, or what if strictly greater than so unsa ma po dey mga solutions ug inana we say shortcut we say general form pwede ba dili na ta maghimog mga table actually okay, because table is actually takes time so is there a rule actually there is and i'll talk about that next